marathon day. I'm just about to head out. It's uh, right at like 3.40. Um, trying to get to a bus earlier this morning, so that's what I'm going to do. So I'm going to head out to the bus and get over to the start line, and we will see you there. I'm dressed like vintage mini today. My uh, running buddy Melissa will be dressed like uh, Steamboat Willie, and I just ended up using a sparkleskirt.com uh, vintage blue sparkle skirt. So I will see you there. Oh, and these came from Etsy. Um, I'll have to link that below because I don't remember the name of the shop. But anyway, I'll see you there. Just a quick tip. It is so long before the race starts after you get on a bus. So I like to eat my breakfast on the bus instead of in the hotel room. Because if you eat it in the hotel room, then you're huh, like not eating for several hours before the race starts. And by mile two, you're starving. So I'm usually try to eat my breakfast on the bus. And I brought it all with me. We made it to the bus drop off. And we're headed to the family reunion area. We're going to meet up with my buddy. Oh, it's so cold. This is actually really good running weather for sure. I'd like it a little bit warmer though. since the marathon's been around, starting it with 1994. That was kind of funny. mile five out to approach the Magic Kingdom. Running through the transportation bus area.
tons of fun people in uh, fantasy land. <laughs> I have to think about it for a second. So Donald is out here where Goofy was yesterday. And the line was short. See? It was stopped right there. So we decided to take it. There's Woody and Jesse today in Frontierland. Yeah. There's mile six. Whoa! <laughs> Look at this! Holy smoke! Look at how cool this is! Oh my gosh! Look who we found! Bye! Somebody running in a wedding dress? Oh, excuse me. There is the genie again. Mile eight. Okay. Oh, look at a mine train ride. Mr. Toad Car. Wow. It's old ride vehicles. Look, that's Snow White. Right, I think that is What? And what is this? Oh my gosh, and the little thing that, that went across the little. Oh, gondola. Yeah. That is so cute. This beautiful land. I'm curious to know what all these artifacts are from. I knew the others, but I don't know the last couple. Very interesting. Hello, this adventurer is keep moving forward. The Adventurers Club salutes you. Oh. Is that the guy? Yes, I'm the guy. Don't trip over that glove. Somebody's hand got worn right there. It's oh. Hades from Hercules. He takes us by the wastewater treatment plant. My school is all together. I can't look down that way because we're still not turning around. I want to be going that way, not this way. Thank you. Bananas at mile Great 12. Job. Great job. Oh, it's Lion and King performers. How oh, cool. Oh, it's a bunny. 
sweet. It's cute. I know, that's so cute. So cute. Her name is Penny. Mile 13 in Animal Kingdom. So it's about 9.30 and Animal Kingdom opened at 9. I am headed to Everest because that's one thing I regretted not doing last time. So I'm going to see if I can get on in a reasonably quick manner. <laughs> Runners are uh, jogging through the line. <laughs> Almost on Everest! I gotta text my husband. My husband's like, oh, you are the best. 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 Oh, you are the Backside of Animal Kingdom, but around the back. <laughs> Do you see that sign about flights of passage? No. It said, "What is this line? That's the, what is this? The line for flights of passage?" <laughs> the Great Diggers are a little early. I feel like they were at mile 18 the first time I ran this. We're about mile 15 now. It's too funny. This is the long road to Wide World of Sports. If I heard that right. Almost to mile 15, I believe. Is it mile 16? Thank you. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much. Good job, guys. Keep it going. Thank you. Keep it going. Thank you. Slowly but surely, I think. And I'm saying this right now for the record. I'm never, ever, ever, ever doing this ever again. <sighs> okay, ESPN Wide World of Sports, we are here. Ooh. Mile 18 in my world of sports. This is the same track I ran on with Braden. Fun times. There have been several character stops out here. We saw Minnie and there's Goofy. Cute, cute. You rock, man. Thank you. They even opened it. How nice. This is Donald and Mickey in their baseball clothes. Hello. I have to stop. Yeah. Line's not too long. Huh? I said I was about to see are you doing it? Mickey and Donna. <laughs> the longest I've run in five years. Ooh. Go ahead. Finish this thing strong. Are you ready? How many push-ups you give me?
making our way into Hollywood Studios in the back behind Tower of Terror. We're almost to mile, I think, 24? No, 23. We're almost to mile 23. Good times. There's mile 23, and I hear chocolates around the corner. Super excited. Yeah. Oh man, y'all are amazing. Oh my gosh, y'all rock. Thank y'all so much. Yes, chocolate. Look how cute this little guy is in Hollywood Studios. Hello! We wondered how the course was going to be modified because of all the construction. Basically, we ran in behind Tower of Terror, around the corner, down the main street, and back out. And this is a spot right up here where I've discovered that not just super fit people run marathons, that anybody can. I was standing right here cheering another friend on and was like, wow, maybe I could do this too. And that was in 2009. And now we're eight years later, six marathons later. I don't even remember how many half marathons I've done. There we go. Inspiration point. Almost there. Now we're back by the Swan and Dolphin and Boardwalk. We'll be heading into Epcot shortly. Okay. This is perfect running weather. Couldn't ask for better. Here we go. Oh, it's so blue. waiting in line for Dopey but it's like the longest line I've ever seen and I'm glad we did it yesterday so the board over here has wait times and Dopey has a line drawn through it I'm not quite sure what that means does that mean the line never ends I don't know but uh, everybody else's wait time are like you know 10 20 Mickey's like 35 so Dopey's is like eh, it's long oh goodness we're not gonna do it I don't think post-race lunch. Yummy. 